So, James Key has been sn snooped up by, has been poached by, um, Audi, um, which currently is still the Sauber team, and he will take up his position uh, on the 1st of, uh, September of this year, I do believe. I think that that is a good move, and I think that will help Audi. Uh, because I think that that decision was made by Audi, who are um, slowly getting getting themselves uh, integrated into the team, into the Sauber team, before taking it over in 2026. Um, I think the the partnership with uh, James Key and and Andrea Seidel it's gonna work really well because they've worked in the past together. So uh, I I think, uh, to be honest with you, I think the the partnership uh, between um, Seidel and uh, James Key is gonna work out better than uh, the recent um, appointment of Rob Marshall uh, to McLaren. The reason why I think that is because um, I think. Um, First of all, Audi are totally committed to Formula One, um, and yes, they are in other other um, racing series as well. But I think their priority is um, in for on Formula One at the minute, and um, I think with them with them being a man manufacturer uh, as well, I think uh, they wouldn't have um, recruited. James Key, if if they didn't have a clear statement of intent, and uh, I think that's personal. Personally, I think that that is where what um, McLaren is lacking. You know, because um, they they haven't got a uh, they haven't got a uh, works they haven't got a, they haven't got works team status. So uh, uh, my. If I had, to, if I was a betting man, I would put my money on uh, Sauber and Audi uh, to work out rather than the uh, recruit recruitment of um, Rob Rob Marshall uh, at McLaren to uh, work out and make make a huge difference. But uh, anyway, this is just what I'm thinking. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. Cheers for watching. If you do like my content, then uh, smash the uh, subscribe button so that you get notified whenever I upload another video. And uh, I'll, don't forget to uh, smash the activate the bell. And uh, yeah, if you want to support me in otherwise in other ways, then uh, also take a look at the video description. All right, your support lately has been absolutely friggin' awesome and uh, has made me really happy in it during this difficult time so keep it up guys all right speak to you later bye i don't ever slow up no i don't take shit. i got no love for the fakeness if you want to play tough and want to hate this i'll always show up i don't ever slow up no i don't take shit. i got no love for the fakeness if you want to play tough and want to hate this i'll always show up and make a statement